up guys, welcome to the video. This is March 15th. This is the 16 in the link series. We're gonna see how Lynn we can get in 16 weeks. Starting my day off like I do. Starting my day off like I always do with some Kodiak pancakes. But we're gonna try these Kodiak pancake waffles. With little pre-made waffles instead of having to bake them ourselves. I thought this was a good idea. I thought it'd be way more convenient, but the macros, the fat is just way too much for me to try to fit it in there. It's the fat is pretty insane, but I'm fitting it in for the next two days just so I can get rid of this so I don't waste it. But yeah, I would save this for whenever I'm bulking, not whenever I'm not really worried about my macros or calories, but yeah, I'll let you know how these are though. I'll let you know how these are. And I had, well, I didn't have a new weigh in. My weight today, 231 and a half, fluctuated from yesterday. It'll do that, but I'll get into weigh ins and stuff in another video. On to the rest of the vlog. Okay, them waffles were not worth it. They really didn't taste like anything. So I'm probably never gonna buy them again, but what does my Sunday consist of? It consists of driving to Jasper, an hour away from home, picking up my clothes that I left, and then driving back. <laughs> What's up guys, so I just made it home. Currently working on Mason's macros because I think he's gonna start dieting Monday, which is tomorrow. So I'm kind of trying to throw his macros together and his foods. Uh, and I'm doing it literally the same way I made the video two videos ago. Getting his macros the same way I showed you how to and getting his food for him. And I'll probably go to the grocery store with him He's wanting me to. Grocery stores are crazy right now. It's gonna be hard to find everything we want. Not everybody's eating healthy, so hopefully there's everything we need there. But um, yeah, you tired of these transitions? Let me put my hand on the camera. Yeah, I need to switch stuff up. Ah, uh, tell me what. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. Oh, you got me sounding good too. Hey. Okay, tell me what the deal is. You know I'm the illest. She from California, says she don't know where the bill is. Shout out to the hometown, I know that they gon' feel this. When I hit the club, I walk in with a small village. And nothing's off limits. When you got the sauce, you know they run it off with it. Now she acting freaky, she was coming off timid at first. But I guess it really wasn't authentic, yes, sir. What's up, guys? So I helped Mason get his groceries. Now I'm at the gym. I got a little computer work I gotta do before I go in there. The, dude, the grocery stores are insane right now. I don't understand it. There's literally no food, no, like, I was really worried about my health, honestly. Like, I was trying to get a mask to wear, but, like, there's no mask. You can't even get a mask, but I found this one thing you can use that everybody has in their house. Most everybody has in their house. They have, like, a, a lot of them. So, I mean, like, and I haven't seen anybody else do this yet. So, I mean, I figured I'd just be the one to help share. But, uh, you know, you just get one of these bags, put it on your head. It's hard to breathe sometimes but and you can't really see so uh but it does offer like full coverage protection like you're not gonna get anything in your eyes your nose your mouth anything like that everything's covered it's not just your mouth covered we got the 3d on deck gotta do honestly a lot of shit right now before i can go in there but today we're gonna get into uh <laughs> but today we're gonna get into how my training changes whenever i start dieting and I'm just gonna do a commentary over the workout. So let's just, let's jump into that, okay. Okay guys, I'm gonna be talking about how my training changes as I start dieting. First, our goal is to get as lean as we can, but also we're trying to maintain as much muscle as possible. We worked months and months to put on this muscle, so we're not just trying to lose it. Uh, I really just continue to lift heavy. You gotta give your muscles a reason to stay. I stick to eight to 12 reps on most exercises, five to eight on my, the main compound lifts like bench squat deadlift the lowest reps i'll go is maybe three on the main compound lifts i don't really go much lower than that so my reps and my sets they pretty much the same regardless if i'm dieting or not but the intensity of my workout changes by the length of the rest times in between sets if i'm bench squatting or deadlifting i take as much time as i need uh, remember we're trying to maintain as much strength as we can but on all the other movements i do i do 45 second rest in between sets 60 second rest in between if i'm supersetting two exercises also you may lose some strength in some lifts when you're not resting as long as you used to but you'll don't worry you'll get your strength back whenever you get accustomed to the new rest times my main gym has this big digital clock that's pretty convenient for me to track my rest times 
Um, I had noticed how convenient it is whenever I go to other gyms and I don't have a big digital clock or like a clock at all for me to track my rest times. So I download this digital clock app on my phone. So that could be useful. Or, I mean, a lot of people wear Apple watches that that could help. But I don't have an Apple watch and I don't wear a watch whenever I'm working out. And I also add some cardio into my regimen whenever I start dieting. But that's a whole different topic, whole different video. But yeah, I mean, it's really simple. That's how my training changes. Basically, just rest times. And it's been kicking my ass so far. I'm not accustomed to it. Uh, it is kicking my ass. But but yeah, that's how my training changes. Hopefully, you got some value from this. And the rest of the video, let's get to it. Okay, guys. Just finished that workout. Hopefully, you got something from that commentary of how my training changes. Uh, subscribe if you haven't now already. Two videos a week. So I'm on track right now. Hopefully, I stay on track for the next 14, 13, 14 weeks. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed. Subscribe. Again, I just said that two seconds ago. I'll see you in the next video. Stay healthy.